tail fin is looking a bit sad for its mouth. Join me navigating the Trans Pennine Trail for a canal to my right. I've done 10% of my ride, decided to get the camera out. Now I've warmed up, things are underway. Today's ride, 200 kilometers. I haven't done anywhere near that distance since July, coming back from the Pan Celtic race, having recovered over the last few months from a, a fall broken collarbone so I'm really determined to get this done. It's the beginning of November as well as a time recording and it's the beginning of a brand new Audax season 2024 so I've got this registered as a DIY mandatory DIY so I'm gonna ride it get it done get some points to kick off yeah, 24 seasons. So I'm just heading along the Trans Pennine Trail. And slow puncher. I had to plug the tyre in the same place where I plugged it about a month or two ago. So yeah, I'm gonna have to replace that tyre now. for today is fantastic but, uh, as you can imagine I've just been thinking about uh, all the plans what if I can't get the uh, tyre plugs properly yeah must have spent about four plugs well maybe three lost a couple of them inside third one just seems to be holding no doubt losing a little bit of air though Sandwiches, my favourite. Get gloves on, get going again. Just stops for about 10-15 uh, minutes there. <clears throat> Just like my last ride, I bought the tail fin along with me. Just trying to save a bit of money, you know, to shop at the supermarkets. So of going into your co-ops and convenience stores and uh, yeah. I even bought the uh, little stove along with me today, so you know, if, if we can stop thinking about that back tyre, we can hold fast. I can make a brew on the way back. So there's about 3k left of this trail to go. It's just going up and up and up. I've been mean, for a long time. Uh, some steep bits as I head through Warncliffe Woods, and then down the other side towards Greno side. And then, I don't think it's much in the way of hills on the way back after that. Yeah. You know, famous last words. Right, what have we got on? First climb of the day, I think. It's only three apparently in this. Uh, next 5k, 138 meters or something. I love this time of year. The crunch of leaves under your front tyre. No surprises, I got ahead of myself a little bit there. Um, I just come down Oxspring and dragged myself back up and out again. Um, 
11k along here now. Pretty sure this will bring me into Greenwich side. And uh, the sky behind me, beautiful sky. There's uh, been a few dark clouds around, but nothing happened, so. Happy days. Well, it's nice and wide. Definitely uh, baby spots down there. Uh, where there's any for a flat, there's no thing, but uh, yeah, that's pretty cool. Buckley 25 gram protein drinks, pouches. My tail thing is looking a bit sad for itself. <laughs> Sun is going down. So uh, we're near Tick Hill. I'm just heading towards Clayworth now. And it's uh, Grinkley up the Grinkley on the hill. Which brings me into well Nottinghamshire and eventually the Isle of Axome. Just following the normal, well pretty much a normal commuter route home. <coughs> so as expected for this time of year, finishing in the dark. I don't know if I said at the beginning of the video, but <clears throat> this will be my longest ride since July. And uh, that ride back from the Pan Celtic, of which I'll throw a link in the corner. The time I slept at the top of Mount Tor in the Peak District. Matt, put the camera away a little while, I'm just starting to lose my voice. So, um, this week just gone, I started cycling to work again, well, half cycle, drive halfway and cycle the rest, and it's made me realise how much I do, in fact, like riding in the dark. I forget how good it is sometimes. So I'm currently in Belton, about 5k from home, and I've just got to keep pumping it up every uh, 5k now, it seems to be more and more frequent. So it's really, really annoying. So that tire's gonna come off when I finish this. <laughs> oh, so frustrating. It's good that I've got a really good pump, but I don't know, just stopping for like two, three minutes at a time. <laughs> 